Since yesterday, we have confirmed 27 new cases of COVID-19. This means that 146 cases have now been identified in our province. We suspect up to eight of these cases are community transmission, although we have information only on seven and are waiting for confirmation of the eighth. Two individuals are receiving care in ICU, which we have announced previously. I must also sadly report the first death from COVID-19 in our province. This individual was admitted in the ICU in the Edmonton zone on March 12th and passed away late yesterday. This patient was a male in his 60s with underlying medical conditions. This is extremely sad news and all of us involved in Alberta's COVID response feel this very deeply. All of our thoughts are with this man's family and loved ones. AHS assures me that they are supporting them in this difficult time. As heartbreaking as this news is, it was expected. This is a dangerous virus. While most people who become ill with COVID only experience mild symptoms, it can make others very sick. Today's sad news is precisely why we are taking aggressive measures to reduce the spread of COVID-19. The restrictions we have put in place on mass gatherings, the closures of public recreation facilities, and the limitations on restaurant capacity, these are all efforts to protect the public's health and prevent spread. I urge you to take these measures seriously and do your best to limit your social interactions and practice social distancing. We won't provide any additional details on what the underlying medical condition was, again, wanting to limit um, information on individual identifying information. Uh, but unfortunately, this individual is someone who did seem to have acquired the disease in the community, and we were not able to find any travel linkages or close linkages with a confirmed case.